What's up everybody, Boss Winter here, welcome back to GTA 5. So, I wanted to apologise for saying I've not been really making videos on this game because recently I have been ill, where I could hardly speak, and uh, coughing and everything else. I could not do videos, even though I said last time I wanted to try and get more videos out of this game, but if I was ill, I will not going to make videos on this game. So now, I feel better, I'm back to doing this game, and I kind of actually can't not wait to do more of this. I've recently just started feeling better. But uh <laughs> literally I really, really was really annoyed that I couldn't do more of this game because I was obviously ill. And uh now it's over, we can get back to this. So uh what did we even do last time? I remember doing a mission for Dom for the first time but we were thinking of doing something else. Oh uh, well Trevor went crazy and now has a his house is now the strip dog which I could never show again. And now we are, we plan to get, do the the big one, the big heist. But we're going to start with this thing here before we do anything else to play as the main Sorry. mission. I don't remember this one. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, it's here. You think? Nice house, isn't it? If so. I like it? I'm selling it, you want to buy it? I'm downsizing. No, no, I'm good. I used to sell houses like this all the time, okay? I sold dreams, I made lives meaningful. I'm not sure about that. How much you like? You like beautiful <laughs> things, though, don't you? Sure. Well, I just happen to know the most beautiful woman. You want a bouncy bouncy? Josh. Josh Bernstein. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the Josh Bernstein. Yeah, I never heard of you. Oh, well, I used to be a big deal once in real estate, and so I had my license taken away. My meal ticket. Where's the chick? I'll get to that, I'll get to that. See, it's not really, it's not really money that I'm after here. It's just it's a little something more awkward than that. Now, Lenny Avery. <laughs> he, he was my best friend. And now, he has taken all of my clients. All of them. Do you think that you could take out all of his for sale signs? That was easy. She's worth it, man. I love you. I love you. I love you. Lenny Avery. Oh. Yeah, I remember that mission. Um So um yeah the sales signs not really going to be doing that on camera because again they're not use useful. We'll see if I can find one to prove it, uh, show what it looks like. Gosh, it's so damn rainy. Why is it rainy so much? So this is a, this is one of the sales signs right here. These purple ones are, are the ones you need to take out. As there's Lenny Avery right there. That's who we are after. We did get a message from Josh at a website that shows us all of his. So you can go random, it's not guessing and looking for them, you can easily find them and just literally click on one of them, it says get directions and it will show you where they are. Which is literally right next to me, so I'm going to go at this one as well. So get directions, go back to the map and it shows where it is. All we need to do is basically just hit him right away. <laughs> that's that. Or you just want him over. Whichever one's easier. But that's pretty much all that is. And eventually we'll open up another six pages of freaks for him. And then, yeah, it basically just. Yeah, it just carries on with a few more missions. I don't really remember his missions. I don't remember that was his mission. This is how I forget how many things these people have. Oh, there's another one there. Uh, I think we'll go to the main mission after this. I'm not doing all of them. Just showing these two off, and then I think that'll be it. If Trevor wants to get up. There we go. So let's go do Michael's mission. We was going to do Reed. Franklin does have a mission, but it's uh, it's Dom again, and I don't want to start off with Dom again. It is, it's kind of a, that's kind of a harder mission. Let's go see Michael. I think I know what this mission is. I think. I know. If it is, then 
going to be a good mission. It's going to be a good mission. I do like it. Hey man. It is. It is. Fuck. What do you want? I'm your friend. I don't want anything, man. Come on, your company's good enough, huh? Same as always. Yeah, thanks. I really appreciate that. So, family ain't back yet, huh? <laughs> nope. Oh, she's a goddamn fool, man. Despite all the chaos of these last few weeks, I think I finally figured it out. I know, no? sounds ridiculous. No, actually, it does not sound ridiculous, you know? Because you, you're a killer. You know, you are a man of action. You do not sit on couches, you take scores. You're back, man. We are back, all right? All we gotta go do is bust out Brad, and then we're golden, man. Franklin, he makes us multicultural. Lester makes it cyber. We're like modern America. We just get ourselves a gay friend. Bam! No, it's not it. I got money. It just makes you miserable. I want to make movies. Great. It's great. And uh, so where exactly does this leave me in the second act of your life? We're gonna do this last big job, and then we're gonna dissolve the partnership. This is not a game to me! All right, this is a fucking way of life. I got a fucking family! Yeah, well, I got nothing! No one gives a fuck about me! I do. Oh, fuck you! I saw your grave. I mourned you. And then it turns out that everything I fucking thought about you was wrong. Everything. You're not dead, and you're not a man. Well, what the fuck are you? I'm your fucking nightmare! Yeah, enough with your goddamn threats! I mean, let me just ask you something. All right, something I've been, I've been thinking about. Up in North Yankton, exactly who was buried in your place? I never gave it any thought. You know what I'm thinking? I had no clue. You treacherous piece of shit! You're fucking dead! You're fucking dead! Fuck. Trevor! Hey! T! So you can be Michael in this perspective. I'm not sure if you can now. No, you can be Michael in that perspective. But I, I don't. I don't I'm always Michael. I'm not sure if it'll change. Fuck you! Hey, come on. Where are you going? You know where I'm going. Fuck you! You don't need to go all the way to North Yank to find out what I can tell you over a couple beers back in my house. Come on. We we'll order pizza. Fuck you! Fuck your pizza. Fuck everything that stands. This is insanity. I didn't want to. 
So Trevor is thinking of someone in a grave, if it's not my fault, then who is it? I kind of figured it out obviously in the first game. I think everyone might have figured it out the first time playing the game. But we like to do it like this. Like we don't act like we don't well, if we ever get there in time, this car is smooth. I've never actually been Trevor during this mission. I've never actually done this at all. Oops. I didn't hit the mic. So I've never actually seen Trevor's perspective at this part. You can't. I don't. You can't even be Michael, which is actually. I don't know. I guess that's kind of disappointing because some people might want to be Trevor, and some people might want to be Michael. But these would be kind of things I'd be going over after like playing the game again. Just because I've completed the game, it won't mean I'll be fi I'll be like not doing videos on it. There'll be fi there'll be videos I'll be doing, like how to do the jewelry store a different way and do the other heist different ways. I'll be doing wa I'll be doing things like that. Because there'll be some ways I don't know or remember. The big one I only do it one way anyway. Let's go to North Yankton. First time ever going back from this. Like, we're 80 something percent during this game finish, and we're going back to North Yankton now. I thought this was way, way back. <laughs> but obviously, I'm doing all the other, like, missions, strangers, and freaks, and stuff. We're doing all of them. So I guess it kind of makes sense that I'm going back now. It's so good. It's actually good to be back to this game. I have literally have not been on this game since last time playing doing a video on it. Literally not touched the game at all. Jesus, this thing's not feel safe in the rain. It's rained the whole episode. This is kind of bad. <laughs> Shit, dude, there's some Chinese men looking for you, asking where you are, where you're flying. It's the Chinese people. I don't think, I didn't tell you, I swear I didn't. Well, that means you did then. Um, yeah, that's gonna be a problem, a Chang. The people that the O'Neill brothers took off us until I, no, took out the O'Neills. <laughs> Literally. This guy is so cool looking, Jesus. Time. Is that why you flew out here? Huh? Tell me I'm wasting my time? Go ahead, dig it up. I don't give a shit. Yeah, that's what you look like. The guy who doesn't give a shit? That's ridiculous. How long are you gonna keep lying for, Mikey, huh? When's it gonna stop? It happens in the dark. It comes out in the light. Oh, give it a rest, Trevor. There's nothing there. Is it? Moment of truth. And there you go. Oh, oh. it's a 
if I didn't know. Brad! <laughs> Look, we do what we gotta do to survive. This thing, it didn't work out the way it was supposed to. Oh, how was that, huh? With Brad in the can and me in the ground, or, 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 or both of us in the coffin. Brad got shot. You saw it. He didn't make it. I got shot. I did. That, that's it. I think the only thing that didn't go as planned was me showing up on your doorstep ten years later. Mikey, I mourned you. And I missed you. But I got a fucking family, Trevor. We were all gonna die. He did die! You reptilian motherfucker! I didn't want it to come to this. Yes, you did! You just don't have the fucking balls to do it! But I do! I got more to lose than you! Never a truer word has been spoken, brother! Now pull the fucking trigger! You ain't got the guts. Take the fucking shot! Who is that? Fuck! 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 Joe Phillips! Mr. Joe has requested a word! Hey, ho, ho! I'm not the guy you're looking for! Hey, how did you miss? How did you miss? Get the boyfriend! Boyfriend? Motherfucker! Hmm, hmm, hmm. No goal, man! You guys are gonna fuck up the camera! Where are you? Who are your friends, T? Stop the man! Don't fight us! <laughs> Trevor, you dick. Give yourself up. We could have teamed up. Someone had a shotgun. You're on ice, Rick. Come on. Four of you? Oh yeah, my plane, my weapons were removed from the plane. Oops. Yeah, most of them are headshots. <laughs> I've been doing all headshots. More vans, of course. Oh, you forgot to check the train schedule. <laughs> yeah. Trevor. Fuck! Come on, I don't know you. Don't this off. You got nowhere to go, boyfriend. All right, all right. Get out of the fucking car. <laughs> Trevor had all planned out. He already had a plane ready. It's not an, it's not a hard mission, but it's, it's, it's nice to go back to North Yankton and leave the mission, even though you only go for one mission. 
Trevor Phillips Industries. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know Ooh, my eldest son, Tao. Bitch. Yeah, the ex-nut. Backed out of a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. My friends miss you in North Yankton. I was hoping we could talk. <laughs> was that your people? Ah, oh, of course. So I had to cut out. Your operation causes problems for me. I want to expand into Blaine County, but your business and your temperament prevent me from making inroads. Oh, well, too bad. I don't know what you can do about that. I've already done something. We <laughs> have your lover. Whoa, 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 whoa. My lover? My Cody Santa. You live in your trailer together with the maid. And then you were alone in that big house. Well, you're clearly very close. You know, how much will you give up for his safety? <laughs> My lover! Yeah, right! It's a tough break. I never want to double-cross a friend and put him in danger, but you gotta do what you gotta do. My business ain't go- I'm serious about Oops. this. Lover. He will die. Tell him I love him dearly. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. Mean, I went to press down to see the map, and every time you have a phone up, you press down on the arrows. It literally just skip, 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 blah, skips some of the uh, dialogue, which is stupid. So one lied to me. Oh shit! Yeah, no more. Um. Yeah, <clears throat> Michael's been taken and uh, Trevor got away. Hey, Michael's car's still here as well. Oh, Jesus. Moment of truth. Of course. But why, wouldn't it, why wouldn't it be mission time? It's always damn mission time. Okay, I'm going to do one thing. See if it works. Have you reconsidered? Mr. Tech, lay it out for me again there, Bro Rice. What were the options? Forgo your interest in Blaine County, or never see your Mr. Dissenter again. Ooh, mm, my business or my boyfriend. Mm, yeah, that's tough. I guess I looked at that pretty face for the last time. We have delayed acting to give you a chance. Soon, it will be too late. <laughs> it does work. So yeah, you call him again, literally, to just do that. <laughs> Alright, cool. We're taking Michael's car now. So now you can't be Michael. Because he's now been taken. Unlike Franklin and Trevor, who haven't been. Wait, hold up. Oh no, Franklin's thing is going up now. His special got taken down again for some reason, but then it's going back up again. Which is kind of odd. It she was already full before I even got to travel, which is weird. Uh, uh, yeah, we can do another main mission, but we'll be Franklin. Alright, shit, it's time to go. Uh, yeah, you're alright, Franklin. It is time to go. Deliver the rest of the cars. We'll take the car, but I'm gonna take the bike. I don't know what it is about this game, but I really like the bikes, but I'm really bad at, like, driving them. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I'm always cautious when it comes to riding a bike because, well, first of all, you usually come straight off it. And the brakes on it are terrible. On every bike. Not just one bike. Every bike. They're all terrible. I'm looking at my... I'm literally looking at the other screen, the one that's recording this, and it's literally really glitchy. It's weird. We can find a minute ago. It might be alright, who knows. What's crack? Hey, I jacked the last ride on that list. You ready to go? Shit, I'm ready to get paid, nigga. 
Crazy man's got the other ones. Come meet me by Glass Heroes and Strawberry so we can do the damn thing. I'm on my way. So he jet the last car. Very nice, very nice, very nice. What kind of car? I was afraid these are some of the cars you don't see in GTA Online anymore. You gotta watch out, fool! What the shit? Oi. Very nice car. He over at the usual place. Turn off. The boost, homie. How'd it go? Any problem? You know me, huh? Yeah, I do know you, fool. So what you think? Smooth as <laughs> silk. I'm thinking where the blood stains and the bullet holes and shit. Man, <laughs> fuck. The amateur shit behind me. I'm a professional now, like you and them old boys. So tell me what happened. I saw the ride. I took the ride. No drama. No security. No one said, who the fuck is this gangly motherfucker doing in my car? <laughs> That's worrying, man. That's some shady ass shit. Line it up on the carrier, homie. My favorite gangbangers. That's teamwork, Bob. He's relaxed. Boss man's happy. Then we'll get moving. And this old bust ass nigga ain't no boss. Enough, nigga. Get your ass in the truck. Let's go. <laughs> Let's get the truck. Paletto Bay, Sonora Freeway. Sorry, no radio. Can't have it. Can't have that shit. Hey, it's uh cozy in here. Scooch up, up homie. Yeah. Scooch over here. Scooching in that crazy dude? Oh hell no, that nigga snake. Get over here. I don't <laughs> fight. Dang what I heard. All cannibalistic and shit. Frank, what you been telling him? I say what I see, homie. You dig on man me. <laughs> uh, rumor and hearsay. We got a long way to go. I'd get comfortable. All right, nigga, but don't try nothing. How far is it? In this thing? About four hours. Shit. It's your operation, Slick. Shit, if you all right driving, I'm gonna catch up on some sleep. Go for it. It's all right being the boss. Men can be running things, but this fool's sleep. Yeah, I'll be asleep when your ass stop talking, nigga. Some boss. <laughs> He's already gone. <laughs> <laughs> he's already sleeping, he's gone. Dude that creeped on that dude. Michael, this creeping days are done. Well, what you mean? He stopped creeping? No more creeping for him. He like retired from, from creeping. From everything. That's funny because like the boy Frank didn't make some shit about that. And as a matter of fact, I don't even know the dude. But considering the mutual acquaintances we got, I would have liked an invite to the retirement party. There were no party. No party? I use the term retirement euphemistically. Homie, for a dude that kills dudes and eats dudes and fuck dudes, you talk fruit. It's unconfirmed. What's unconfirmed? The fact that you <laughs> talk stupid or the fact that you do some messed up shit? Or where the other dudes at? Like, maybe he's dead. The last one. Oh shit, man. Fuck. Do Frank know about this? I don't know if Franklin knows, but let's just let him sleep. Yeah, it's a bummer. But you know, he wasn't a good guy he made out. Man, dude was a killer, a thief, a liar, and irritable as shit. Yeah, a liar. Above all else, a fucking liar. Homie, you sound like some bitch he ain't called. Like, oh, he lied to me. Mm -hmm. I am some bitch he didn't call for ten years. Fuck, man, he fucked you. He fucked the fucker himself. Shut up. Man, the first <laughs> time's always special. I hope he was gentle with you. The pushing it, man. And enough about me fucking. I don't do that. As a rule. Maybe when I got to LS, I was I was a little overwhelmed by the place. I had a little out of control. But that ain't who I am, for the most part. But the Michael fucked you. Yeah, yeah. The Michael fucked him. And the Michael <laughs> fucked Brad. And the Michael ran off with the FIV. Brad? Who, who the fuck is Brad? Brad is our boy back from the day. <laughs> and Michael killed him? Michael got him killed. 
he died when Michael faked his death. I thought Michael died and Brad was in the pen, when actually Brad was in the ground and Michael was in hiding. And now Michael's dead and it's all okay? Michael's current condition is unconfirmed. I said that. But if he was dead, you'd be cool because of this Brad dude who died whenever. <sighs> yes. Yes. Man, I thought <laughs> you and Michael were tight. So did I. Okay, that make a lot of fucking sense. Hmm. It's a lonely old road, ain't it? Lonely? Hey, I couldn't say. I mean, not really. A road's a road. It ain't got abandonment issues. Truckers on the black top making do. I don't need to make do. I need to make snaps on these rides. Sure. Yeah, the time will come. It's what happens before we get paid is what? Franklin's asleep. It's just me and you. What? What you trying to say? You want me to jack you off or something? Jesus, no. God, no. Of course not. Unless... Man, you just <laughs> sick, man. <laughs> just fiending for some friendship. Friendship? Right, whatever, man. It's just... Truckers are a symbol in this country. No part of its mythology like cowboys, gangsters, hobos, gang gangers. Truckers are about the unsexiest myth I ever heard. Apart from hobos. Uh, maybe tired with hobos. Freedom. Loners in the night. You know what truckers do? Cut up women and get other dudes to jack them off. Come to think about it, aside from not living freight around the country, you got about all the necessary prerequisites for a fine career in Harlem. No shame in that. If you don't want to get paid or enjoy human contact. Money's bullshit. So is friendship. All right, all right, all right. I see you still touching. How's Frank doing over there? Uh, dude getting paid to sleep. Don't even worry about it. Ah, uh, sleep of innocence. So he like in charge on this one? You work for him? He's a kind of figurehead. A puppet, if you like. With Devin Weston's hand up his ass. Right up to the elbow. That dude, real sad. Ooh, it's repulsive. But, well, once he's paid us, he can be whatever we want him to be. What you want him to be? I want him to be Dead. someone who understands that all the money in the world can't save him from a nasty guy who thinks he's an asshole. Oh shit, what's that? Wake up, you dozy motherfucker. One time was on a ride. This is what happens when you fall asleep on the job. What you gonna do? All right, shit. I'll handle this. If you keep driving, I'll use the JP700 to get rid of it. Me and Molly said there'd be some hardware on board. Shit, we'll see. Hey, take his head there. <laughs> I can't keep doing that. I gotta keep my eyes on the fucking road. <laughs> He's next to he's next to my favorite car. <laughs> the blue one. Cheetah. My favorite. Imagine having this. Man, you brought the cops right to us, dog. Maybe you should have done the boost, Mr. CEO. Now get on the shit. You're showing a lot, Frank. I know. I don't 
to come out. <laughs> Meditating or ripping somebody off? In light huh. of the drama your efforts caused, we felt it was not perhaps the best idea for you two to be seen together for a while. Where's the money? Mr. Weston is mm. one of the most brilliant investors the world has ever known. He's obviously a maverick, but he's also rigorous in his research. Yeah, he may be brilliant. Look, let me be the first to tell you. He ain't gonna fall in love with your ass. Now, where the fuck is my money? The best thing that could have happened to you in the situation has happened. He is going to hold your money, invest it in his alpha fund, and make the funds available to you at a time as the transfer will not induce any undue attention. Which is a polite way of saying I'm getting robbed? Are you fucking kidding me? That is a short-sighted and frankly immature way of seeing things, Mr. Clinton. Let's go. I boost car and pop motherfucker. Maturity is not really my fucking thing. Again, mission time. You know, I'm, I'm really good at fucking that one up. Literally, I don't know anything else that's fucking worse than that. Franklin, what's happening, Lester? Hey, look, you seen Michael? Man, the contact he set me up with is holding out on the payment, dog. Huh. Um, let's see. His phone is offline. His credit cards aren't active. This is aberrant behavior. Hmm, last usage is for a flight to North Yankton. There, there was a signal from a cell back in Los Santos, but now nothing. Damn, is he in the city, dog? Shit, he could be in trouble, huh? I don't know, but it's worth speaking to Trevor. Most likely he was with him in the Midwest. I'll get him to come see you. Shit, all right, homie. Look, send him to my aunt's crib, all right? Well, that mission is going to be done for the next time. We're going to go do Dom mission first, then I think we will leave it at that. I've got a while to go. I've got a long while to drive. Right, right, Dom. Where's he at? Do I just wait down here? I'm pretty sure I can wait down here, can't I? Or do I actually have to go up there? Bruh. Are you? Mm, That's to make it awkward, don't you, Dom? Oh damn it, man! Fine. What is helicopter? What is helicopter ages ago to do other, other things? And I'm using it for this. <laughs> this is when I was like getting all the collectibles, like spaceship parts and stuff. I use this helicopter for everything. And now I don't use it anymore because, well, there's no pets to get in this game anymore. Except that all of them, the most of them, are pets. But the the ones that are well known, I'd say, are pets. It's surprising how much I know about this game. I just saw Dom on the edge. Hey there, safe, pussy. Man. Are you watching? This is safer than crossing the street. You wished. Shit, bullshit. <laughs> yeah. Well, less people have died doing this than crossing the street. How about that? <laughs> they called me insane when I said sell all your American equities. And now look at this shithole. <sighs> Come on, lady boy. Let's go. Oh! 
Obviously went down way too quick. I don't remember this one very well. Spot, all right? He missed. Fucking missed. I had to turn round. You overcooked it, huh? Shit. I'm the king, the emperor, the supreme being of overcooking. I'll incinerate whatever you put in front of me. Boom! Nuke that shit. And I was just saying you missed a truck, dog. Maybe a gust of wind or something. That's cool. Nah, it ain't cool. Land act reservoir now, bitch. We'll set the slider to maximum and bust your tiny little processor. I'm gone. What? Did he just speak? Did he just speak any English there? Daredevil. I don't give a shit. I don't need to get the gold anymore. I've got one of the hardest achievements in the game. Hi, woman. I need to go take your call. I need to go home and change my clothes again. Because last time I did that in the cutscene, that's what I was wearing. Okay, so, okay, so there you go. So, yeah, I think we're going to leave the episode here. Uh, I think next time, well, no, no, not think, definitely next time. Oh, hello. I'm going to go see Michael. Because, uh, well, Trevor knows where he is. Franklin does not know at all. Neither does Lester. That is a cool view. Damn. And uh, so, it's not going to be, not looking good for Michael. He's kind of uh, trapped right now. But uh, that's obviously down to Trevor. Obviously, because the Chinese were looking for him. And Franklin, well, Michael got caught into it, but Franklin wants to know what's going on. So, next time we'll be seeing that. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of GTA 5. It's really good to be back to this game. I'll, obviously, now I'll be saying I'll try and get it out more. But if you did enjoy it, please drop a like on this video. Leave a comment down below what you think about this video. And hit that subscribe button if you're new. And I'll see you on this video. Peace out, everybody. Goodbye.